guys this is my first ever video that i've probably done on the weekend in a long time i mean my room is super messy right now well not a lot it's mainly my candy on the ground because it's it was halloween what's here it's saturday today you guys it is oh god i don't know what time it is i think it's around like I, I remember my dad going to work at like 8.36, so it's about like 10 right now. So I've been up since about like 7.30, I don't know why I woke up so early. My plan was to wake up super late so that I can film this video like around 4 or so if I go out to dinner or something. Because I know I'm going to have a couple of friends over around 12 and my brother is going to a football game, possibly so it'll just be my friends and my stepmom so today's about to be really fun and halloween was super fun it was only about three or four days ago um i did not vlog i'm so sad i didn't vlog it was dark i had so much priorities you guys so i'm gonna grab my makeup and i'm also going to do an ootd I love my outfit right now. <sighs> my eyelashes are have been growing and they're like so long. Like if I like do you see how long those are? Like anyways, so I'm just in like my bed right now in like this really cozy like gray blanket. And then like this memory foam like pillow. It's so soft. Your head just like sinks in it. I love it so much. I don't sleep with like firm pillows because it makes my neck hurt. And I, especially when I shovel like shiver up like like that, it hurts my neck. And then right here, it's always sore. Like right here, it happens a lot. Um, I've also grown a double chin. Like, bro, for real. Before, I used to have the slimmest neck ever, like, my neck was also really long, which I hated. I looked like a draft in the hallway. We was at school, but anyways, we should get started with this day. You haven't seen my hair. I don't think I've walked with my hair like this before. I might have. It's basically back to normal. It's just like a tiny bit darker with highlights. So, yeah. So I guess we should get started with our day. So let's get up. That's how I get up. My hair is a mess. I brushed it before I got in bed. <clears throat> I was just sitting on Instagram and all my social media and I'll link that all in the description box. I know I always say that, but to be honest, I always forget when I upload it. I'm like, oh my god, I can't delete that now. It's been up. You guys have seen it. It's up. So, I'm about to go grab my makeup thing. Like, on my floor, it's mainly like my bags of candy. That thing is filled with candy. Like, I've literally eaten that much candy this morning, so <laughs> don't mind my weirdness. My face is, like, really ugly right now, so we should get this started. So, we're going to do an OOTD in a second. You guys already saw, like, a sneak peek. So, I am wearing this kind of, like, cropped, like, sweater jacket. It's from, I think it's from Forever 21. Let's check. Yeah, it's from Forever 21. And then these jeans are like they have fishnets in some of them but they're like really cute ripped jeans i love them a lot to be honest like they're like boyfriend jeans so they're kind of baggy which i love so that's my ootd so the jeans are from i think h&m or hmm, i don't know but anyways, I think they're from H&M. So I got to do my makeup. So I'm going to grab my makeup box, which I think is right here. 
forgot where I set like all of my makeup. So I can check. I have oh I have candy right there. Okay. I'm just like moving papers because yeah, I I have to. So I'm gonna go set the camera down to where y'all can see me. Okay. Bro, I love my setup on here but it's a little messy she's our there what girl you know i'll be slaying so i'm gonna just okay. <coughs> sorry i will be doing an updated um like room wait room tour um also at two houses my mom's house and this is my dad's house this is where i keep mainly all my beauty products and only some of them over at my mom's so we're gonna go grab it i think it's in this box right here so it shouldn't be lagging because unless you're lagging so you need to get better wi-fi then sorry um so i'm gonna go get it you can report me if you want i don't really care but i don't care if it's lagging so I'm gonna go get it. Ow. This actually like hits in here. Oh, yeah. I think I'm gonna go with a very like touch up kind of fall but Christmassy look because it's almost over. So I'm gonna start by putting some fans i fancy your um moisturizer to moisturize my face this is about like 17 dollars i think it's like really expensive but we had to get it online so i also got the bigger bottle because i wanted myself to have like a lot and i didn't buy like a smaller bottle for like more because they're cuter <laughs> Anyways, I'm gonna put my hair in like a bun, or like a croissant bun on the top. So I'm gonna just show you guys how I do that. So what I do is I look down and I put my hair down as well. And I kind of just brush it until it, with my fingers, until it all just goes into one. Kind of like bun. And then I kind of just go up just so that I can have that perfect bun. And then I go like this, like this, like this. And then I grab it, I go like that. It's all done. It looks terrible. I've never really had any good comments on it before, but I don't expect you guys to even comment on this because, like, what the heck is that? Anyways, my face is so dry. I kind of want to learn how to do edges, even though, like, I'm not the race to do it. I don't know. But my friends are always like, oh, my God, you have the right baby hair to do edges. And I'm like, no, thanks. I just apply my moisturizer like this because... There's really no point in like sticking my fingers in it every two seconds to get like a drop so and this stuff is pretty cold as well so it kind of also like wakes up my face in the morning as well so i'm just going to look first and this is probably going to be like a longer vlog this isn't really a vlog because i'm not going anywhere but I still really like highly don't know the definition of what a vlog is like <clears throat> sometimes I don't do vlogs like sometimes I actually have sit down conversations which aren't vlogs are vlogs I think when you're planning something but yeah oh my god my face is so freaking smooth and shiny as you can see my neck is like a dr just kidding <laughs> i could do this bun like way better but i'm not gonna try to 
Then the next thing that I do is some foundation, which this is the Revlon Color Stay Whipped. This thing is really expensive. Well, this is like twenty dollars for this. I'm almost out of it, which is like super sad. So I'm gonna have to work with it, guys. It's so sad. I gotta buy some more. I always like to put on my foundation before anything else. Some people do concealer first, but I typically like to do that after. And I don't like feel like that because it makes like this weird grease marks. I just like to go like that. I put a lot on this brush. And the shade to this is um, it doesn't say the shade, but I know this is my shade because the lady at Sephora gave it to me. She was like, this is your shade. And I was like, oh, okay. It was like I have like a really big forehead and I think I have a really big forehead. I wish I had like half of it. So actually, I don't think I'd have a forehead if that was actually my forehead. So I would put on concealer today, but I think I had like a pretty good sleep to where I don't need it. <clears throat> so yeah, now I'm going to put on some highlighter. I'm really bad at putting on highlighter, but this is a palette that I have. I think I'm gonna put on everything else first. And then after my highlighter, I'll put on my mascara. So I'm not sure what shade I want to do because I, I only get the small palettes because if I buy a big palette, I know that I'm just going to use one color. So, <clears throat> my throat. I want to have like a more like top glammy look. So I think I'm going to go somewhere that's a little lighter. So this is the LA Color Palette. This was only about like $6. But I think I'm going to use this shade right here with the mix of this shade so that it's a lighter color. So that should be really cute. I'm just going to apply the rest of this foundation. There. So I think I'm going to use... Um, this brush today let me make sure okay so i'm gonna be using this daniel eyeshadow base <clears throat> on it's really cute i hate the little spongy brushes i always throw them away i just don't know why i didn't throw this one away it's really confusing to me and since I got like a lot, I always like to collect that. I'm not trying to go with like a really high definition one today. I think I'm just gonna go with like a really casual, like on the go look. So. This look is just really mild, to be honest. In my opinion, I love the look. I'm gonna open up my blinds. So yeah, my look is pretty good right now. It's just like a very like smooth kind of red color. So yeah.
and I'm going to apply that to the other side. This is probably one of my favorite colors on my whole entire palette because it's not as like big and mild or big and fancy. Oh no. <laughs> if anyone's wondering on my channel what this is on my nose, it's either a birthmark or a mole. My mom found a out about it at three when she was trying to scrub it off. It was pretty funny. <laughs> I almost did my eyebrows with that. I was like that because I was thinking about my eyebrows. So this is my eyebrow palette. It's called Sweet and Shimmer Eyebrow Stuff. It's usually in the well container, but I got all sorts of colors, like weird colors, like. <laughs> but I found my color in it, so I use it. Because before my eyebrows were looking like really dark. Like my eyebrows match my hair obviously. But like my eyebrows were like dark. Like this dark. Like my hair isn't that dark. I just want my friend to come over already. I usually try to do a cut crease as well. But it doesn't always work because who can really do one that perfect? I barely ever wear makeup to school. The top I've ever done with makeup would probably be oh well, there guys the top i've ever really done with makeup at school <clears throat> would probably be just concealer like if i didn't go to bed like on a right like basis last night like let's say today i had school and it's about like six o'clock in the morning even though it doesn't look like it let's just say i have a big ring light on or something and I have to go to school, then I would just apply some concealer. That's probably it. So, yeah. Now I'm going to put on this Chanel um, mascara. I'm actually running out. I need to go get some from my friend Ava's house. She also has concealer. I do not have concealer at the moment because I used it all, which is pretty sad. So, I just get the tiny little, like, eyeshadow or uh, mascara because I rarely ever use it. People always tell me that I should wear makeup to school. I think that nobody should really be wearing makeup to school because nobody is really in the right age. Like, I feel like if you're, like... <clears throat> let's see let's see if you're like 14 15 or 16 like that's an exception because you're in like high school eighth grade um <clears throat> which so am i so i guess that's the age that we should be doing it like no sixth graders fifth graders should really be wearing makeup it's a little too early, so. I don't do my bottom lashes as often. So, I hate doing the, <clears throat> I 
hate doing the opposite eye because like it never looks good. So that's the stuff for the eyeshadow and mascara. Now I'm going to try and apply some highlighter. This stuff was pretty cheap just for like a main like circle one. I love this stuff a lot. Sometimes I um, put it under my um, eyebrows. Which I'm probably going to end up doing because I might be going somewhere and I want my eyebrows to pop a little if you know what I'm saying. So I'm not trying to have that like dirty kind of look under my eyebrows because I haven't done my eyebrows in a long time to be honest. So I'm going to put this under it when I'm done with my eyebrows. So just got to plug in my camera. Because it's soon about to die. I love this like just general look with foundation, eyeshadow, mascara, and that's about it. I don't try to go out all the time, but I try to sometimes. So I think I'm going to use one of these brushes today to do it. I think I'm going to use this one. It's like a gold blue one people say like these are paint brushes but like paint brushes are actually really good for doing your eyebrows especially if they're fine point then they you can like brush up with them as you can see but people say that all my paint brushes look like um like actual makeup brushes which is like okay i guess but like at the same time like people always think that i'm lying so it's pretty sad. I also have a pet peeve when people go like this to their eyebrows. So then anytime I see it, I have to brush their eyebrows back to normal. I don't use like a brush to do it because it just feels really weird. As you can see, this one's more like out. Now this one's like skinnier and like not brushed. Sometimes I don't even do my eyebrows because they're so like on point in the darkness to go with my eyes and I just like poke them up like that with like my natural face because like they're more really like down and they just go in a shape like that. But I can make them in a shape by just going like this. But people think I'm mean when I do that so I'm like... Comment down below your age and your favorite sport. So this is a really like pokey brush, so it's like for your eyebrows, I guess. Sometimes I just have to do this to see where my shape is. So there's that. <clears throat> so now I'm just going to take like a little bit of a lighter kind of stuff and go ahead and apply that on my eyebrows.
So I just try to apply a little, not too much. So, this eyebrow actually looks a little bit darker than this one, and like more thick, so I'm just trying to push that up. So, I'm going to look in my big mirror up here to see how it looks. I just checked and they're like on point girl they're like on fire so we're gonna put on some highlighter with this brush right here because it is like it's like sideways so that it can fit right there I'm gonna go ahead and apply some of this. You already know you gotta put some under them lids. Make the side of you pop. So I'm not for real sure how this is turning out. I never really spend a lot of time doing my highlighter because I really never do it, to be honest. So... So I literally just seen it. Now you can see where it's highlighted. I also need to highlight my nose a little. I also highlight like up here. But not too much. Now all we have to do is put on some, you already know, lipstick or lip gloss or something. Probably attach some hoops or something. I can already tell that this look is awesome. The camera makes me look really pale, which I hate. But actually, I'm recording on my 
phone today, so if you look over, my face actually looks darker. So I guess that's an advantage. So now I'm gonna pick out a lip gloss. I know I have like a really good one. I mean like a really good one. So I have all like the Kylie lips. But I think I'm gonna put this one from Ultra. So these are all my Kylie ones as you can see. But I think I'm gonna put on this one from Ultra. It's just like a pink shiny sheer. And I believe it goes with like my eyeshadow a little. But yeah, so this one's from Ultra. I would originally do like these ones from Sephora, like the Kylie ones. I have a lot of these. And then I have like this weird one from It's Be. Um, I don't know the brand too, I never use it. I only use like the name brand stuff that I buy because I don't know how the other stuff is going to look on me. So I think I'm going to put this one on. It's like a big stick. It's from Ultra. It's called Shiny Sheer Lip Gloss. There's really no other point to it. It's like really shiny, so. Comment down below your age grade and where you're from Everybody is like snapping me on my social media. I love you guys so much. And that's the end of my makeup routine. So hopefully you guys liked and subscribed to this. What does that mean? Like... Close up there. Challenge, sit in front of the camera and give a close-up of your bare feet and toes for one whole minute. No thanks. So this is the look. I'm really loving this look. I do this look probably like every day. But, no. I'm not I'm not gonna get blackmailed to do something if I don't wanna do it, so I'm good. So you can report me all you want. I forget don't care. Because, like, my YouTube channel, I've made a video about this before. My YouTube channel is not for, like, people to tell me what to do. And I don't care about subscribers, likes, and all that stuff. I just enjoy making videos and talking to you guys on live streams. I do live streams for a reason. To get to talk to you guys, not just make videos and like your comments. Like, that's kind of pathetic. If you're going to actually be a YouTuber, you should actually talk to your subscribers, like, you guys are talking to me, but, like, I don't want to do what you're saying because, like, this is a makeup routine. Like, this is what I'm, like, I'll make a video, like, probably around, like, noon or something with my friends of, like, a Q&A question. And then you can, like, join that probably around, like, 2.30 or something.
but like when I make a video, a certain video, it should be on the topic that I say it is. So there should be really no point. I know you did. But this isn't like a challenge video, so. Sorry to be rude and all if you think I'm being mean, but like I'm trying not to be. So, yeah. Hopefully you guys enjoyed the 35 minutes and 22 seconds. And I'll see you guys later in another video. Probably a Q&A or like a mukbang or something. So, yeah. See y'all later.